Hey guys, thanks for joining us today. Mike here at Weeby Autos. Today we have a beautiful car. It's a 1988 Mercedes-Benz 560 SL. It's finished in white with a blue interior and just awesome. I got Mike here who's going to tell us a little bit about it. How are you doing Hi, Mike? Mike. How are you? Good. Mike, Mike. Mike, Mike. <laughs> yes, an 88, which is the um, last generation of the 560 uh, SL, which is considered the most collectible and the best of the range. This one is a 64,000 documented mild car. Wow. In uh, superb original condition. Uh, finished in white, as you said, with the dark navy blue interior. Uh, what can I say? Everything on the car works exactly as it should. Super All straight body. It uh, runs beautifully. Got new tires on it, which I just put on. The other ones were fine, but they had a little dry rod, so we okay. put tires on. Um, you can see no dings, dents, no cracks in the leather, no cracks in the dash. When we get inside, um, engine runs perfectly. Um, I don't know what more is there to say. It's yeah. a really good specimen. Highly desired. It is. You got the hard top. Yeah, hard soft, soft tops top. blue. Soft tops navy blue original. Okay. It's in excellent condition. It has one small plastic tear, but it's on this portion here that we, uh, on what's called the rear seat panel here, so okay. you don't see it when you're driving. Okay, I it's see. It's been repaired, but other than that, the top is perfect, and it's the original top. This is all original interior, and it's leather, well, not MB Tex, uh, which. You know, considering that leather doesn't quite wear as well as the Tex, uh, you see how nice the condition of the yeah. interior is. Beautiful, 64,000 miles. 64,000 miles. Wow. All this room's work. The Decker AM radio, or AM FM radio had lost its um, code, which we sent to Becker. Mm -hmm. They uh, re reset it, so that works perfectly. Great. 64,877 miles. Jeez, so gorgeous. Everything works, even the power antenna, huh? I believe it does. That's, really <laughs> That's awesome. Everything was really intense. Wow. What a pretty car, Mike. Yeah, I took it to a local car show mm -hmm. um, last summer just for the fun of it, and it won, you know, best in its class. Uh, those shows are mostly based on condition, mm -hmm. you know, rather than rarity, and uh, they checked every little aspect of it. Cool. And it came out very, very well. Pretty honest car, it really is. Let's fire it up, Mike. Okay. So smooth, right? Yeah. So I'm like sewing machine. But I don't know if many people realize yeah. that this is one of the fastest cars on the street in its day. It was a 5.6 liter double overhead can, double overhead can, fuel injected engine. And they don't realize that if you kick down on it all the way and yeah. downshift, the thing roars. It's yeah. really a quick car. Because yeah, the power to weight ratio of a 5.6 engine with all that sophistication in a car of this size, it makes it a really it's like Corvette speed of the day. Mm -hmm. You know? Sure. It's plenty, plenty fast. Most people never get in it. I've taken folks out uh, who have had these cars and picked it down and they said, geez, I never even knew it did that. <laughs> sure. Man, it's beautiful. Yeah, that's the, the extra, sunscreen. Yeah, so that's an optional sunscreen, uh, not sunscreen, windscreen. Windscreen, so yeah. It doesn't blow your girlfriend's hair. Nice spare. Yeah, it's a beautiful shape. Yeah, what a pretty car, Mike.
think these are the next ones to come up with value. Yeah, they are. They're starting to move because the you know the little 280s that preceded it up through two, up to 71 are all over 100,000. So in a chain like this, yeah, uh, a 280 SL would be 125 to 150,000. Yeah. So these have started to pull up as a result. Yeah, I agree. Way more sophisticated than 280, also. Yeah, well, it's a much much better car, but you know, there's that there's a charm to that car that can't be yeah can't be disputed. Absolutely. Pretty pretty. Yeah, this was the same engine that was used in the large sedans, the 560 SELs. So you can imagine the difference of power in this small yeah. car compared to the, and that, those were quick by themselves. Yeah, they were. The 560 SEOs. Big cars, they were all like 5,000 pounds, those things. Yeah. <laughs> but they moved along and they would, you know, yeah. 120 on the Autobahn all day. Yeah. Well, guys, thank you so much for joining us today. Any questions at all, feel free to reach out. We're at 631-339-0399. Uh, we do offer worldwide shipping and financing, so give us a call. And Mike, thank you so much for showing us your car. My pleasure. Good Guys, you. yeah, thank you. And uh, reach out, give us a buzz. Let's talk about it. We hope to hear from you soon. Thanks a lot.